How's it going everybody? Today I'm going to show you how to make the infinite energy machine in Aibotic Factor. And so obviously this is everything you'll need. I think I'll put all the recipes up on the screen. But for now, what you want to do, do you want to, you want to grab your two barricades here. You want to face this one away. You want to place it. And then this one. And so they'll face out like this. However you want to grab two laser emitters. You just get up on here and face them so they're in line with you. They're in line with this little ledge here. Make sure that's all good. Awesome. Then you're gonna grab your power converters. And then you want them to face out like that. Make sure they're facing out to this platform here. There we go. Brilliant. Then you want to get your plug strips. Just place them on the wall here. Make sure that you can put them anywhere basically, but I'm just going to put them here because it's more clean and organized. You want to grab your makeshift battery, put it anywhere on the ledge here. Awesome. You want to grab your carbon batteries. Maybe you want to face them out like this. And basically, these carbon batteries is what's going to... They're going to recycle energy. And it's going to create new energy. So, this system creates new energy. Uh, through the lasers. And it goes through the carbon batteries. The carbon battery recycles it back into the system. So it's all perpetual. Right. I think that's it. Now what we want to do <coughs> is we want to... <coughs> sorry. We want to put the power converters to the batteries. Make sure I do it on both sides. Alright. Then we want to put the battery to the plug strips. Now, we want one of these power sockets to go here. One of these power sockets to go here. So, this side, the power socket will go on this barricade. It's going to be the opposite. I mean, same for this one. Alright, now that we got that done, we're going to connect this, this middle, and this to this middle. Alright, now, we've got the machine done. This will infinitely recycle power. But I'm just going to show you a couple extra steps. So first of all, we want to go ahead and we want to charge this battery. Just a tiny bit. Don't need that much power. We're going to connect it all back up. So... This goes here. This goes here. See, it'll start to go. We have to give it a bit. There we go. So now it's starting to create new energy. And you'll see is that it's getting recycled into these carbon batteries. So what's happening is the laser's going out, it's going into this makeshift, and then the makeshift goes into the plug, and the plug turns this one off, and then it powers this carbon battery. And then this carbon battery powers this laser. So when this makeshift runs out of battery, it's, it kicks up this side. And then when this side runs out of battery, it kicks on this side. And so it's recycling, and recycling, and it's creating new energy through these makeshift batteries. And it's just all dumping in the carbon. Now we can take use of that, and what we're going to do is we're going to combine the systems together. And grab two laser emitters. It doesn't it doesn't have to be fancy, unless you can make it a lot more cleaner, a lot more compact. I think in my first design I made it um really compact, but it was really hard to follow. And you'll see only one comes on. 
So when this one runs out of power in the carbon, then this one will turn. Then this laser will turn on. We'll see it cycle through to the other side. There we go. Ever you see this laser turns on. So that's what that's basically what we're banking on. Ah! Oh, let me just turn that around. Oh! Now this is a this is a cheat world, which is why I'm able to build these instantly, just so it's easy to show you guys. So now when that turns on, so whenever it cycles, I'll always have constant energy supply. But obviously, it'll turn off. There's a there'll be a second delay turn off. So that's why I have this. So what we're going to do is we're going to connect the system to the industrial battery and we're going to turn the industrial battery into a null loader, which you can uh, read more about on my guide I'll link. There we go. And then that's infinite energy out of this socket right here. You can power anything infinitely and you'll see as time goes on, the carbon batteries get more and more power. I think I'll show you. Yeah, you see how the carbon batteries. So they'll gain more and more power over time. Now I have been experimenting with some other ones. One down here. They all work well, but they don't work as much as this one. And I think this design right here is very compact and it's very nice. Thank you guys.